dati sinabi nila, kailangan mong mag-graduate ng college para makapagtrabaho. Look at what happened right now. The internet leveled the field. So, nakikita nyo, maraming nag excel sa internet na hindi naman college graduate. So, yun yung bagong ekonomiya natin. Yung internet is the new network. Kasi, ganito kasi yan eh. Nung college, pumunta ka ng college, nag-network ka, so meron kang mga kilala. Yung mga ahead na professional, network din. So, sila yung mag sa inyo, yung mga younger generations. etong internet is level the ground. Like, you can do networking sa internet through home, then mag-communicate ka lang through the social media. Once you gain that audience, pwede ka nang mag-kumita. So, yun yung mga famous content creator. Even though they did not finish their education, but their strategy works to become a millionaire or billionaire even. So, meron yan, mga nakikita nyo. Mga, they always show their possession. So, kanun Instant fame yung internet kasi ngayon. Kaya, kung gusto nyong umaman, mag gawa kayo ng social media, generate a social media, grab their attention, once you grab their attention, generate the enough audience, then sell the product or sell the solution for your product. Then, kahit 3 to 5 lang yung bibili niyan, as long as you offer the right value to your customer, magwo-word of mouth po yan. Magmo-multiply po yan. So, ganun yung strategy ginagamit ng mga content creators right now. They're not only focusing on grabbing your attention, but at the back of their mind, they're also become entrepreneur. That's why the internet leveled the ground right now. So, instant fame ka sa internet, instant ka rin yayaman. Not only that, but the promotions will also coming in terms of internet once you reach a certain kind of audience. So, ganun siya ka bilis. Kasi for previously, yung internet, uh, yung connection natin is via television. So, kung sino lang merong access ng television, sila lang yung may mga information. Right now, with the internet sa mga bukid, naabot na sa bukid, yun nga, mas mabilis kumalat yung information mo, mas mabilis kumalat yung pangalan mo, mas mabilis kang yayaman. But, regardless of that, if your only metric of success is pera, think twice because hindi lang pera yung metric ng success. Metric ng success means also that nagiging impactful yung mga ginagawa mo sa kapwa mo and how do they how do you impact in their lives and were you able to solve help them solve their problems yun nga a lot of the content ngayon is more of entertainment but never upskilling that's why i'm encouraging everyone Kung meron kang skills, pa-share sa internet. Level up the game so that internet will be your playground. Okay? So, encourage yung gustong mag-start ng social media or YouTube. I'm not doing this for my own, but I'm doing this for my future. Because 
yun nga, once na gustong malaman ng mga apo mo or yung mga younger generations kung what did their grandfather do, eto, at least, etong video na to, kung andito pa yon sa YouTube, pwede natin may share or pwede lang mapanood na, ah, ganun pala, ka-intellectual yung grandfather nila. And that's why, and that's the greatest contribution to humanity is to knowledge share. Di man to for personal consumption, but yun nga, more of a creating an impact. Ga, anong naging inspiration ka sa isang tao para gumawa ng mga ganitong bagay? So yun yun ka-powerful yung internet ngayon. So, internet, that's why careful on consuming the social media. Kasi ngayon, ah, yun nga, kahit ano na lang ginagawa na content just for fun. In which, okay lang siya, pero meron ako mga nakakitang content na grabe na rin. Inhuman na. Gumagawa lang sila ng funny, pero in, in reality, yung impact is no longer humanitarian. Kaya, that's one of the lesson that I want to share with you guys na yun nga internet is also since you have a large audience be careful on the information you are sharing and be mindful for them okay because yun nga may, baka maraming susunod dyan yun maraming salamat and